John Adams, A Founding Father's Legacy. Welcome, everyone. Today, we delve into the life and legacy of one of the United States' founding fathers, John Adams. As the second president of the United States and a key figure in the American Revolution, Adams played a crucial role in shaping the nation's early years. From his political endeavors to his personal convictions, John Adams left an indelible mark on American history. Let's explore his life, achievements, and enduring influence. Early Life and Education John Adams was born on October 30, 1735, in the town of Braintree, Massachusetts, which is now modern-day Quincy. He was the eldest of three sons born to John Adams Sr. and Susanna Boylston Adams. His father was a farmer, deacon, and town councilman, while his mother hailed from a prominent family in the area. Adams grew up in a modest household, but his family valued education and instilled in him a strong work ethic and a thirst for knowledge. At an early age, Adams displayed remarkable intelligence and a keen interest in learning. His father, recognizing his son's potential, ensured that he received a solid education. Adams attended local schools in Braintree, where he received a classical education in subjects such as Latin, Greek, mathematics, and literature. He excelled in his studies and showed a particular aptitude for languages and rhetoric. In 1751, at the age of 16, Adams enrolled at Harvard College, where he continued to distinguish himself academically. At Harvard, Adams immersed himself in a rigorous course of study, delving into subjects ranging from philosophy to law. He developed a passion for politics and was deeply influenced by the Enlightenment ideas that were gaining traction in intellectual circles at the time. Adams graduated from Harvard in 1755, ranking in the top of his class, and went on to pursue a career in law. After completing his studies, Adams apprenticed with a prominent lawyer in Worcester, Massachusetts, where he gained practical experience in the legal profession. He then returned to Braintree and began practicing law on his own quickly earning a reputation as a skilled attorney and orator. Adams's education and early experiences in law would lay the foundation for his future career in politics and public service. His commitment to scholarship, coupled with his strong convictions and sense of duty, would shape his approach to leadership and influence his contributions to the founding of the United States. Revolutionary Activities John Adams played a significant role in the lead-up to the American Revolution and was a prominent figure throughout the Revolutionary period. His revolutionary activities spanned from his early opposition to British policies to his involvement in the drafting of the Declaration of Independence. Here's an overview of John Adams's revolutionary activities, opposition to British policies, Adams began his involvement in revolutionary activities by speaking out against British policies that he viewed as unjust and oppressive. He vehemently opposed measures such as the Stamp Act of 1765, which imposed taxes on printed materials in the American colonies without their consent. Adams believed that such policies violated the rights of the colonists and laid the groundwork for future conflicts with Britain. Boston Massacre in 1770, tensions between British soldiers and colonists in Boston erupted into violence, culminating in the Boston Massacre. Adams played a crucial role in defending the British soldiers accused of murder in the aftermath of the incident. Despite his own anti-British sentiments, Adams believed in the importance of due process and fair trials. His successful defense of the soldiers earned him widespread respect and recognition as a principal lawyer and advocate for justice. Continental Congress. Adams was elected as a delegate to the First and Second Continental Congresses, where he became a vocal proponent of independence from Britain. He played a key role in drafting important documents and resolutions, including the Olive Branch Petition and the Declaration of Rights and Grievances. Adams's eloquent speeches and impassioned arguments helped galvanize support for the cause of independence among his fellow delegates. Drafting the Declaration of Independence Perhaps Adams' most enduring contribution to the revolutionary cause was his involvement in drafting the Declaration of Independence. 
alongside Thomas Jefferson, Benjamin Franklin, Roger Sherman, and Robert Livingston, Adams served on the committee tasked with drafting the historic document. While Jefferson is credited with authoring the final version of the Declaration, Adams' influence and input were instrumental in shaping its content and tone. Diplomatic Efforts In addition to his work within the Continental Congress, Adams played a crucial role in diplomatic efforts to secure foreign support for the American cause. He served as a diplomat to France and the Netherlands, where he negotiated treaties and secured loans vital to the American war effort. Adams's diplomatic skills and perseverance helped forge alliances that would ultimately tip the balance in favor of the American colonies. Overall, John Adams's revolutionary activities were characterized by his unwavering commitment to the cause of American independence, his dedication to principles of justice and liberty, and his skillful navigation of the complex political landscape of the time. His contributions laid the groundwork for the birth of a new nation, founded on the principles of freedom, democracy, and self-determination. Diplomatic Endeavors John Adams's diplomatic endeavors were instrumental in securing crucial support for the American cause during the Revolutionary War and in establishing the United States as a legitimate nation on the world stage. Here's an exploration of Adams's diplomatic efforts. Minister to France, 1778-1779. Adams' first major diplomatic assignment was as one of the commissioners to France alongside Benjamin Franklin and Arthur Lee. Their mission was to secure French support for the American colonies in their fight against British rule. Despite facing initial challenges and setbacks, Adams worked tirelessly to cultivate relationships with key French officials and diplomats. His efforts eventually bore fruit when France formally recognized the United States and entered into an alliance with the American colonies in 1778, providing vital military and financial assistance. Diplomatic Mission to the Netherlands, 1780-1782 Adams was later tasked with securing loans and diplomatic recognition from the Netherlands, a key trading partner of Great Britain. Adams faced numerous obstacles in his diplomatic mission, including British efforts to undermine American interests in Dutch markets. However, his perseverance and diplomatic skill ultimately paid off, and in 1782, the Netherlands officially recognized American independence and entered into treaties of amity and commerce with the United States. Treaty of Paris, 1783. Adams played a crucial role in negotiating the Treaty of Paris, which formally ended the Revolutionary War and secured American independence from Britain. As a member of the American delegation alongside Franklin and John Jay, Adams worked to secure favorable terms for the United States, including territorial concessions and fishing rights. The Treaty of Paris, signed in 1783, established the boundaries of the new nation and laid the groundwork for peaceful relations between the United States and Great Britain. Minister to Great Britain, 1785-1788 Following the end of the Revolutionary War, Adams served as the first American minister, ambassador to Great Britain. In this role, he worked to strengthen diplomatic relations between the United States and its former colonial power. Despite lingering tensions and unresolved issues, Adams's diplomatic efforts helped lay the foundation for future diplomatic engagement between the two nations. Vice Presidency and Presidential Diplomacy Adams's diplomatic acumen continued during his tenure as Vice President under George Washington and later as President. He faced challenges such as the XYZ affair, in which French agents demanded bribes from American diplomats threatening to disrupt diplomatic relations between the two countries. Adams' response to the crisis helped prevent war and preserve American neutrality in the conflict between France and Britain. Overall, John Adams's diplomatic endeavors were characterized by his skillful negotiation, tireless advocacy for American interests, and unwavering commitment to securing international recognition for the United States. His efforts played a crucial role in securing vital support for the American cause during the Revolutionary War and in establishing diplomatic relations with key European powers, 
laying the groundwork for the United States to emerge as a respected member of the international community. Presidency John Adams' presidency, spanning from 1797 to 1801, was marked by significant challenges and accomplishments. As the second president of the United States, Adams faced political divisions, foreign threats, and the task of defining the presidency in the wake of George Washington's tenure. Here's an overview of John Adams' presidency. Election and Inauguration, 1797. Adams was elected as the second president of the United States in the election of 1796, narrowly defeating Thomas Jefferson. He took office on March 4, 1797, succeeding George Washington. Adams's presidency began at a time of increasing political polarization, with tensions between Federalists and Democratic Republicans running high. Foreign Relations One of the central challenges of Adams's presidency was managing foreign relations, particularly with France. Relations between the United States and France deteriorated following the XYZ affair, in which French agents demanded bribes from American diplomats. In response, Adams successfully navigated a diplomatic crisis with France, avoiding war while also strengthening the U.S. Navy to defend American interests at sea. Alien and Sedition Acts Adams's presidency was controversial due to the passage of the Alien and Sedition Acts in 1798. These laws, aimed at curbing dissent and perceived threats to national security, were criticized by Jeffersonian Republicans as unconstitutional infringements on freedom of speech and press. The Alien and Sedition Acts led to increased political tensions and contributed to Adams's declining popularity. Economic Policy Adams faced economic challenges during his presidency, including a financial crisis and tensions with Britain over trade issues. He worked to stabilize the economy by implementing measures such as increasing military spending and imposing taxes to fund defense efforts. However, Adams' economic policies were met with mixed results and did little to improve his standing with the American public. One-Term Presidency Adams's presidency was marked by political divisions within his own party and opposition from Jeffersonian Republicans. Despite his efforts to navigate domestic and foreign challenges, Adams faced criticism from both sides of the political spectrum. In the election of 1800, Adams lost his bid for re-election to Thomas Jefferson, marking the first peaceful transfer of power between political parties in U.S. history. Legacy John Adams left a lasting legacy that continues to influence American politics, law, and culture to this day. Here are some aspects of his legacy. Defense of Liberty and the Constitution Adams was a staunch defender of individual rights and the rule of law. Throughout his career, he consistently advocated for the principles of liberty and justice enshrined in the Constitution. Despite facing criticism and opposition, Adams remained committed to upholding the ideals of freedom and democracy, leaving a lasting legacy as a champion of constitutional governance. Role in the American Revolution Adams played a pivotal role in the American Revolution, contributing to the cause of independence through his diplomatic efforts, advocacy for colonial rights, and participation in the Continental Congress. His contributions to the drafting of the Declaration of Independence and his diplomatic endeavors helped secure crucial support for the American colonies and laid the groundwork for the birth of the United States. Leadership as President As the second President of the United States, Adams faced significant challenges, including political divisions, foreign threats, and economic instability. Despite the controversies of his presidency, Adams demonstrated leadership and integrity in navigating these challenges, preserving American neutrality in foreign conflicts and upholding the rule of law. His commitment to principle over partisanship set an important precedent for future presidents. Promotion of Education and Intellectualism Throughout his life, Adams emphasized the importance of education and intellectualism. 
He was a lifelong learner and avid reader, with a deep appreciation for literature, philosophy, and history. Adams believed that an educated citizenry was essential for the success of the Republic, and he advocated for the establishment of public schools and libraries to promote knowledge and enlightenment among the American people. Family Legacy Adams's legacy extends beyond his own accomplishments to include the achievements of his family members. His wife, Abigail Adams, was a formidable intellect and influential political advisor, known for her correspondence with John and her advocacy for women's rights. Their son, John Quincy Adams, followed in his father's footsteps, serving as the sixth president of the United States and making significant contributions to American diplomacy and governance. Historical memory and commemoration. Over the years, John Adams has been remembered and commemorated in various ways, including through statues, monuments, and historical sites dedicated to preserving his legacy. His contributions to American history are celebrated annually on President's Day, and his life and achievements continue to be studied and admired by scholars, students, and citizens alike. In summary, John Adams's legacy encompasses his defense of liberty and the Constitution, his pivotal role in the American Revolution, his leadership as president, his promotion of education and intellectualism, his family's contributions to American history, and his enduring impact on the nation's historical memory and commemoration. Adams's commitment to principle, his dedication to public service, and his unwavering belief in the ideals of freedom and democracy have secured his place as one of America's most revered founding fathers. Thank you for your time. Be sure to like and subscribe if you liked this video.